Look, it boils down to this Nobody's going to do anything for you You're gonna have to get up off your lazy behind And do it yourself if you're tired of being in there Then pay attention Get a copy of the small claims lawsuit from the empowerment series You mend it to fit your situation Go after the judge's bond You don't need to know the bond number You just have to send a request To the court asking for the bond number The judge, the prosecution clerk of the court and the public defender's office you're going to highlight the fact that they by having you enter a plea did not tell you that by doing so you were admitting to the genius of the record And testifying against yourself That by taking of your fingerprints And photo and having that used to others against you Was a violation of your right to property And it violated due process of law Since you were told that if you could not afford an attorney One would be provided for you These items were taken prior to the appointment of counsel Which means it was a violation of your due process rights To speak to counsel Finally the public defender worked for the attorney general's office The prosecutor worked for the attorney general's office, each working for the state. The judicial officer worked for the state. This was unfair because each of these officers of the court conspired together to assure your prosecution. And also the state utilized a foreign jurisdiction known as a foreign judgment to cause persecution for which it had no jurisdiction in the first place. So I am bringing forth this as I am bringing. You are to provide your bond information The address, name of the bond company The amount of the bonds, the specific name of each bond And any retaliation under any circumstances brought As a result of the quest will result In additional claims, you have 21 calendar days to provide this information And as custodian of records, you are to readily have it available Your policy, what the bond company says That the moment you receive a claim You are to forward the information to them immediately This simply sue their bond You threw the bonder's name of the judge Bond to one and the insurance company Has name of the bond insurance company Don't do Don't worry about whether or not They give you the information You're suing it as a dope And as a doe, they will have to provide that information in small claims court Now this is a due process violation And failing to give you that information So you are suing them For failing to provide that as information in small claims court Now this is a due process violation